question four. So part A, for how long did she stop? Now, you just need to become familiar with a travel time graph, a distance, a distance time graph. Time's passing along the bottom, and this column here represents the distance that we are from Jasmine's home. So no, no kilometers away, that's when we're at Jasmine's home, and so on. Now, she stops when she no longer ha is having a change in distance away from Jasmine's home. Do you see in this little bit here, for a while of time, for a period of time, she remains two kilometers away from home. So she must have stopped. This is the bit when she's at rest. So how long is this one square? So we have to become familiar with the, the um, scale. Notice how 9.30 to 10 is over three squares. That's 30 minutes, so each square must be 10 minutes. We're talking about one square while she stopped, so 10 minutes. Now, Jasmine stayed at the park for half an hour. So first things first, we know that's going to be three squares where the distance from home remains unchanged. So we need a horizontal line here, 10, 20, 30 minutes. So that's that bit there. Now, we're then told that she walks home at a speed of 7.5 kilometers per hour. Now, this takes a bit of thought. 7.5 kilometers per hour, that's 7.5 kilometers over 60 minutes. Now, we're interested in knowing how long it takes her to get home from being five kilometers away. So, let's sort of try and scale down and then scale up again to get to five kilometers. If we divide this by three, we get two and a half kilometers being 20 minutes. Divide by three, divide by three. And then if we double this, we get that five kilometers takes 40 minutes. Now five kilometers is exactly how far she has to go, so it has to take a 40 minutes. 40 minutes is four squares, because each square is 10 minutes. So given this is when, when she leaves the park, uh, she needs to get home one, two, three, four squares later. So you can do X marks the spot here. At this point, she's got home again. She's no kilometers from home. We're told that she walks home um, uh, at a speed of 7.5. We've got to assume that's a consistent speed. Uh, uh, so this is going to be a straight line. So we do a straight line from here to here.